Hey, this is Sean OTD, and welcome back to Is It Worth It? Today, the Cloud Company. All right, so as always, let's just dive right in. Uh, we're going to start out with Arise, a pleasant, smooth, billowy twist to the original fan favorite Mother's Milk. Okay, that was an awful. So uh, it says that it's supposed to be Mother's Milk High VG. This is their Max VG line. It is quite a bit different, actually. Um, the custard is not quite as sharp or as sweet. This says um, cream and strawberry. Um, I know the other one said, I think graham cracker, I think was in the description. So it looks like some of the graham crackers out of there. Maybe that's what's cutting some of the that custardy sweetness out. It is very smooth. I mean, very smooth. Um, it's like, the difference between getting some crappy, cheap, generic, hard candy, and then going and getting some like Werther's original butterscotch type stuff where it's really creamy and smooth. This is very creamy and very smooth. Wow, so far we're off to a great start with Cloud Company. So let's go ahead and move on down the list here. Uh, we're going to go to uh, Rebel. Sweet, creamy, berry-infused cereal, other times tangy, fruitful goodness with a splash of citrus. Hmm. So you may have just discovered your new all-day vape. Oh, I like cereal. I really like cereals flavors. So, uh... I'm really anxious on this one now. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that is a sweet tasting Fruit Loop-like flavor. Um, very smooth, very delicious. Mmm, that's fine. Mmm, yeah. I mean, I, the cereals are usually my all-day vapes anyway. Oh my gosh, this would, yeah. Yeah, this, this, could, this could break you. This is bad. That's a fantastic cereal flavor. Um, high, with a high VG, I get the clouds I want. Um, since they engineered it to be a high VG flavor, it still has all the, uh, the flavor that you really want out of a cereal flavor. At the same time, you get all the cloud you want out of a, of a high VG juice. That, whew, right right now, I'm gonna say that's my favorite one. Uh, that, that's, that's in the number one spot. That is, that is truly good cereal. So let's go ahead and move along uh, to the next one, which is going to be Sky. Sky is a sweet, tangy, savory, creamy. Oh my. You know what? That tastes identical. Identical to those... Um, those lemon cakes with the with the frosting, that that's exactly what it tastes like. Um, I don't get the lemon cookie with a drop of cream. I get that sweet lemon cake with the sweet frosting on it, and it is freaking awesome, man. Um, I don't know. That's that's really good. Um, Dang. 
dang, that is just spot on lemon cake. I mean, spot on. Um, that was good. Holy crap. Um, Pip knocked it out of the park on this set. I mean, so far, every one has just been amazingly good. Um, this is below caramel coated coconut cream cake has been sunk down in e-liquid bottle size. So here we go. Just as sweet and supple as it was the first time I tried it. Um, so I think it's the, uh, the, the cream and the caramel together mixed with the cake that gives it that cinnamony flavor. With very, just very soft undertones. Um, I mean, I, I assume the undertones are the coconut, but it doesn't taste like, bam, here's coconut. You know, it doesn't taste like I'm, you know, vaping sunscreen. I mean, it's, everything is very smooth and subtle. Uh, and it kind of blends into this medley of just smooth, sweet flavor. That's fine. That's, that's, that's really good. Yeah. Okay. So, um, the newest one to their line, um, Kumo, Japanese for cloud. As a blend of mixed fruits together with sweet tangy yogurt. There's the medley. And that is smooth. That is a smooth little yogurt flavor. Um, and the aftertaste, now that I've given it a chance to actually settle and not just vaped it back to back. Now I taste that smoothie aftertaste. So I didn't taste the smoothie on any of the exhales. I tasted like fruit and yogurt and a combination of a fruity yogurt. But then at the end, when I stopped, everything settled in my taste buds and they just kind of relaxed. All of a sudden then I tasted like a smoothie. I was like, oh, well that's where the smoothie is. That's cool. So completely, no, the aftertaste is completely smoothie. Um, that is a fantastically fine juice. Fruity in, yogurty out, smoothie aftertaste. Uh, it seems to be the, seems to be the profile of it. Um, on, a, on a slow inhale, slow exhale, you get fruit going in with a little slight bit of tang and then yogurt out. And then after you finish your exhale and you settle, then you taste that smoothie just kind of wash over your tongue. Yeah, I, I, I can get into trouble with this line. I can see, I can see me wanting to go and buy this line over and over and over again because each each flavor has something I like. Juice quality as impeccable as always by Suicide Bunny. Packaging is amazing. Um, price, same price as every other premium liquid out there. Twenty two bucks a bottle. Uh, availability, go to suicidebunny.com or most vape shops carry Suicide Bunny. Any cons? Um, I don't have gallon balls of it sitting here. Um, so that's about the only con. Um, this is just really, really good juice. Uh, outside of that, all pros. This is by far, is it worth it? Yes. This is my favorite line by Suicide Bunny so far. As always, you know, thank you for watching. Please subscribe and Dave on.